All right, so this is a response to a comment I saw on one of my videos, which said, I was talking about how to escape the matrix and how to, you know, work for yourself, make your own choices, make you, get your own freedom, um, and not have to live your life by anybody else's rules. And somebody said, you know, in response to one of the things I said, how, what do I do if I don't have any knowledge? And what do I do if I don't have any skills? And this is actually something which is really easy for me to answer because in 2020, right, you know, right now, when this is being filmed, this is like the best time to do this. And the reason for that is that you have at your fingertips every single piece of information you would need. If you have a smartphone, if you can go on YouTube, which you can because you're watching this, uh, you can learn anything. You can literally teach yourself any skill, uh, especially things that you can do online. Um, if you wanna teach yourself about any topic, any topic at all, the information is out there, it's free, it's easy to find, and it's available to you. In terms of podcasts, you can look at videos, you can read articles, you can, you can do anything. You can literally learn and do anything online now. If you are looking to you know, try and build a life of freedom where you teach people what you know, and this is something I, I teach quite a lot, is how to um, take something you know, like a topic that you're passionate about, and actually turn that into a business. There are many ways you can do that, but if you don't know anything, if you don't have any knowledge, um, firstly, you're actually in the minority. So that's quite interesting because most people have a hobby or you know they're at least interested in something. If you really dig down into it, it just might be the case that you don't think what you're interested in, other people are interested in. Let's say if you're obsessed with breeding tarantulas, right? You might you might think in your head, nobody else is going to care about that, but they will. You know, trust me, that's a big industry actually. Um, and teaching people online how to care for tarantulas is a big industry. Now, I'm not saying I have a website about tarantulas because I don't, but I could do. Um, and that's something that even if I knew nothing about, I could learn about that. I could teach myself, you know, how do, how do I care for tarantulas? Just think of all the questions in your head that you might want to learn, type them into Google, teach yourself the thing so you know, and then rewrite it onto your website, rewrite it into an ebook, make a video about it, present the information in a better way. I don't know how long this opportunity will be here. You know, the opportunity to actually just take information that's already out there, repackage it, and then turn that into a business. I, that might go away next year. That might go away in six months. I don't know. But the thing that will never go away is if you make content and put it out there, if it's good content, it will get attention, it'll get traffic, and in almost all cases, you can monetize that traffic and make money from it. Um, now, this channel, I don't want this channel to be a business channel or, you know, how to make money and things like that. But if you are not knowledgeable about not knowledgeable about something. This is a very easy time to teach yourself about whatever that thing is. It's a very easy time for you to go and learn something, teach yourself about that topic, and then put the information out there. So that's it really. I actually um, didn't plan on making this video, but I thought I would start making smaller, more often videos on this channel, just answering people's questions and things. So if you do have a question, by the way, about anything I post on this channel, Transcend Your Limits, uh, just leave a comment. Leave a comment in the, in the underneath the video. I'll try and make a response to it, um, and I'm going to try and post, you know, more often. I don't want to say daily because I just probably won't be able to stick to it, but I'll try and post more often on here. That's what I would say. If you if you don't know how to do something, you can easily teach yourself using what's called Google or YouTube. So that's it, guys. I'll see you next time.